Hey everybody, this is Craig Nine Volt Games, <clears throat> and today I would like to just do a little video of something that uh, I figured out that Dan actually called me about. I figured it could be a little helpful. Um, if you buy a Vita game used, where you accidentally sign in with the wrong profile, you will not be able to get the trophy data on your regular PlayStation ID account. Now, I'll teach you how to get rid of this data because there's not a lot of tutorials on it uh, online about it. Now, what Dan did is he accidentally signed in with his extremely old PlayStation ID and uh, wanted to get trophies on his new one, and he couldn't. So every time he signed in, he got a message saying that this is already tied to another account. No trophies will be received. Do you wish to continue? Now, what you need to do on the, on the home screen is go down to the data. In this case, I've already erased it, so I don't care this time. We'll do Marvel vs. Capcom. It's Katamari. Marvel vs. Capcom is on here. Now, a lot of people think that you just got to go in and you got to delete the memory card data. It's not true, because now the Vita cards actually are memory cards. So you need to delete that. And in order to reformat the card, you need to have the card in, the Vita slot, and then you uh, hold on to the icon, and it'll go into edit mode. It'll actually have boxes around the icons. You'll have a dot, dot, dot above every one. You click on that, and then it'll ask you, delete your information. You delete it. Like that. <laughs> delete it, and you say, okay. Oop, I can't see, I'm looking through the camera. You delete it. And it deletes. And while you hold it onto it again, or back, and it's gone completely off the thing. Take the card out. Ugh. Uh, shiny because it's in the light put the card back in and it will reinstall it onto there and that is a brand new style game it deleted all the data that was on the card there now you can go ahead and you can get all the trophies you want thank you guys for watching